children, how you doing today? You're, you're paying attention. Everybody doing well? Come on, I can't hear you. Doing well? Bring me down musicians. I want to hear the children. Children, you're doing well? Yeah. Lick a bit higher. You're doing well? Yeah. Oh, Lord of mercy. Miss Cutie Cutie, I think you know what we're going to have to do today? I know to get some noise out of them. I think we're going to buy some ice cream for all these kids today. Oh. Children, you're doing well? Yeah! <laughs> you know this out of stock? Listen. Y'all got, well, you can't have brought me because my bank account is heaven. But I'm tempted to say a double or a triple scoop. What's your favorite? I can't hear or no. Chocolate. You want double or triple? Triple. Of, of course. Why did I ask that stupid question? Well, let's make some noise for Jesus. All right. We want. Uh, we want to anoint them. We're just gonna. We're gonna. And in the congregation, let's pray for them. The reason I'm saying this is this. Children are heritage, number one. But number two, ladies and gentlemen, children that are growing up in the world today have to face things that we never, ever face. That's why instead of telling them they're not ambition and they're not going to mount to nothing, pray. Pray. You don't have to face half the stuff that they have to face. And on top of that, we keep speaking death over them, right, man? Your heart, your ears hard, eh? You're, you're good for nothing. Stop. We, listen, we break every word, Kurtz. That's been spoken by anybody, including people in their household. I lose Isaiah 54, 17 over them. That the weapons may form, but it cannot prosper. And every tongue that rises against them in judgment, we condemn it now. For this is the heritage of the servants of the Lord. And their righteousness is found in you. Children, before we begin to pray, listen, don't talk. Pan the altar when we have the microphone enough. Because you know what I would do? I would call you out from the altar and I'll stand you right next to me. You think it's easy? Yes, I will. And everybody will look at you. I will give you the mic and make you talk. You want, where's the old Jesus? <laughs> oh, I like this little one here. Come here. Give me a hand. Be obedient. You're good. I'm, this is not a punishment. This is a blessing. Come. Suppose, suppose we want to bless you with some foreign money. You're going to say no? She's brave. Very brave to me. She's so precious. When I said it, she says, Lord Jesus. You're, you're well behaved. I wasn't going to call you. What's your name? Aubrey. Aubrey. That's my granddaughter's name. Yes? You see how God works? Stay right here, Aubrey. Children, I want you to do something for me. What's your name? Jamaica? <laughs> Jamaica, well, well, well something went wrong if you didn't name Jamaica. And a Jamaica, you're born. If you get a little brother, tell your mother to name him Jamaica, yeah? <laughs> eh? You need another brother, name him Jamaica. <laughs> Children, listen, before we pray for you, I want you to do something for me, okay? The Bible says that you're fearfully and wonderfully made by God. by God. Look at me, Jamaica. Because I know sometimes, children, you want to look down. Look up. Look at me. Look. Look here. I want you to understand that you're beautiful. You listening? I'm going to start clicking the one on the talking. You listening? I can't hear you. Ice cream truck soon passing and you should move. Talk quickly. I want you to know that you're beautiful. Whether you're dark, light, or in the middle, you're what? Beautiful. Whether you're tall or short, you're what? Beautiful. Whether you're slim or a little bit portly, you're what? Beautiful. Put, come on, you're what? Beautiful. Don't let anybody tell you, yes. go with the God. Well, you have to bleach your skin. Or you have to, they're doing it. Or you have to pinch up your nose. Do you understand me? You're made in the image, image and the likeness of God. Put your hand on your chest. And when you say it, say it like that on the ice cream now, okay? Maybe we'll, we'll put a little extra with it. Say, I am fearfully, I am fearfully and, wonderfully and wonderfully made. made. Because, I am made because I am made in the image, in the image and the likeness, and the likeness of, God. of God. Again, I am fearfully, I am fearfully and wonderfully, and wonderfully made. made. Because I am made, I am made in the image. And the, and the 
likeness of God. One more time and louder to the tent roof. I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Because I am made in the image and the likeness of God. Amen. Sister Charlotte briefly is going to come and she's going to pray for you. I want to tell you who she is. 40 plus years as a pediatric nurse in Georgia. The Lord spoke to her and told her she's going to work with children. Connected her to an organization called uh, Metro World Child. The largest children's ministry in the world. They go into how many schools? 19 here. 19. And little Aubrey saw her and ran up to her and said, you came to my school. Oh my children God. recognize her. Just None of these children, you're in any of these schools? No, I want her, her, I want her to tell you the four most important things. Mm. Quick, That's quick, it. Oh, quick. Four most no, important things. Aubrey, we are pretty in but you're this too much about you. Just it's about Jesus. Up. Open up your mouth. You're, you're, listen to me. Lift your hands. Lift your hands. Lift your hands. Listen, we know the Jamaican school, a top school in the world. Hands up, one hand, it. All right. <laughs> two of them, lift two of them. How about out of all these kids, God would be have her bring her up? And the Lord spoke to me this morning, Aubrey, to reach back to my daughter to tell my granddaughter, Aubrey, to send an orphan for a child in Jamaica. Oh. And that child happens to be you. Oh. Oh. So why you for move when somebody called you? What's the four things you learned from Metro? Jesus loves me. Yes. I have sinned. Number two. Jesus died for me. Number three. I need to decide to live for God. Come on, you never stand for Aubrey. Me have me, me a sweat like a bottle. Me have a cologne. It still smells fresh. Don't, don't go too far. So Aubrey, yes. Minister Charlotte now is over Metro World Child Jamaica. Yes. They go into schools all over the island and they minister. So I'm going to have her to pray. Go over to God and after she finishes praying, go over to God. We'll get to the word of children. I, I'm going to keep my word. Ice cream is on me today. Okay. Javan, he has come into the schools with us. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Javan, Javan. 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 Everybody was a child at one time. Yes. And when she ran up to me yesterday and she said, uh, you were at my school, you were at some. And I said, what was the top truth? Mm. And she was able to tell me that God created her on purpose. Hey. God created her on purpose. So I'm uh, from the, de everybody's gonna pray this prayer. Every adult, you got, we're gonna pray this prayer and she's gonna lead us a little child shall lead them. Yes. So you're going to lead everyone in this prayer. And now it's there are four most important things. Four most important things. All right. Number one. Go ahead. God loves me. God loves me. I have sinned. I have sinned. Jesus died for me. I need to decide to live for God. I need to decide to live for God. Now come on again. We're going to do it again. Come on. All right. So we're going to do it again. After three. One, two, three. God loves me. I have sinned. Jesus died for me. I need to decide to live for God. We're going to have to do it with come some pep. Come on. Come on. After three, one, two, three. God loves me. I have sinned. Jesus died for me. I need to decide to live for God. I need to decide to live for God. One more time. After three, one, two, three. God loves me. I have sinned. Jesus died for me. I need to decide to live for God. I need to decide to live for God. Let me tell you why we do this. 
if I say, if I say A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. Why did you say that? That's a word for a child. That's a word for a child. As a child, repetition. When the children go to sleep and we teach them, God loves me and I have sinned. Jesus died for me. I need to decide to live for God. It comes out. What goes in comes out. None of us can say where the moment is when that becomes a reality. And so we have to teach our children. So even now, Lord, I thank you. I thank you for this place. I thank you for the ministry. I thank you for Apostle Fidel and everyone on here. As we have gone through Westmoreland, we are in 19 schools right now. In, in March, we ended doing 11,000 children for the month. That's where we're reaching. We're reaching children with the gospel. We go in and we tell them bitterness only hurts them. Yes. We tell them, teach them how to forgive. Yes. We teach them how to ask Jesus into their lives. My God. As a little child, we are bending them. We are not part of the problem. No, no. We chose to be a part of the solution. solution. We're solutionists. Yes. So Father, right now I give you thanks for every child. Oh God, every big kid in the back. Lord God, that it is, we have the four most important things in life. That God loves me. I have sinned. Jesus died for me. I need to decide to live for God. I need to decide to live for God. Amen. Let's celebrate the Lord. Aubrey, thank you. What's your name, little man? The Nevada Campbell. Thank you, Nevada. Thank you for Aubrey. Jamaica and the rest of you. God bless you. What's your name? I can't hear you. You have some pretty eyes like me. God bless you. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Whoever the youth leader is, Let's get the total for the ice cream so we can, I don't know if we can get, get it to the children but, but, oh, at the end of the service, but we'll, we'll eat it whenever you want. Why? No, we couldn't get to the, to the altar before, but we can't get to the for leave. <laughs> you're dismissed. Okay. Little miss. Right. You're dismissed. Glory to God. Highway assembly, listen. Yes, sir. Future, sir. Doing the things the same way all the time and expecting different results is madness. Madness. We have to be in the service. We know we have a program, but we must be sensitive to the spirit. Yes, yes, yes. Woman of God, do you know that there was... Oh, I will see.